What's up guys, Seth Kiban here. Now in this video, I'm going to show you how to combine shapes or how to take the combined shape effect from your um, canvas or your project. Let's step into Photoshop. You want to first pick your shape and then click on maybe ellipse tool. Let's say that's what you want to use. And once you create it, you can also click here and create another one again. Now you can see it all falls under two different particular layers. And that is how normally it was supposed to be. But sometimes this is what you actually have. Once you have something like this and you want to create another one, um, it just creates everything on one particular layer and you don't know what to do. Now, even though it looks like <laughs> it is on one particular layer, how do you go about it? The first thing is let's right click it and then let's create the first ellipse. Right, and then the second thing is I want you to go to this part. Now this is the options. It gives you new layer. Click on new layer. This way you can create another shape and it's going to be on the next um, layer for you you can click on the move tool and you can move it around all right and you can even come back and create another shape again and then it's totally going to be on a new layer you can click on your move tool and you can still move it around but then here is the thing if you let's delete all these let's click on our ellipse tool now if you have this selected combined shapes and this is what you are going to have you can see this is what you are going to have you're going to click over here this is what you're going to have and once you click on your move tool and you try moving it around it is as a whole it's difficult for you to actually edit it also the other thing you can do is you can create two different shapes like that and then perhaps you want to merge them together let's give this one maybe a different color all right now it doesn't matter the color you create once you merge them the colors are going to be one you can bring them together like this and then you can click and select both of them and then once you click on Control e it's going to merge it together now you can also come and click on your ellipse tool and then actually come here and then click on merge shape components and that is how the professionals do it click on merge shape components and then it becomes as one particular shape guys if you love this particular video hit the bell icon and subscribe to this channel as well guys see you in the next video